pay attention. And listen to Black Men starts now. The divorce happened within a couple months, yeah. I believe. Like within a year, he was married to yeah. the best friend. He's That's old. Like, mm. Old people don't be playing no more. There's yeah. two people that don't play when it comes to love and marriage: old men and women in their thirties. They don't, because <laughs> that clock is ticking on both their So okay. you trying to say he was in a rush? Like, I got. Because he like, I ain't got that many years here. I got them. Yeah. He, he got like ten more summers. <laughs> He got like 10 more summers left. So then let's ask this, since he got 10 summers left. Can, <laughs> can men and women be platonic friends? As long as one is ugly. Mm. So you have to be ugly? <laughs> somebody, <laughs> somebody got to be ugly. Yo, somebody turn the <laughs> mic off. <laughs> <laughs> somebody got to be ugly. Man. And we well, just we don't Hold on, wait a minute. You and I are friends. You calling right. me ugly? You could try to say you want to <laughs> Hey! <laughs> got it. I'm just saying. <laughs> it's two sides to this coin. And she ain't say no. <laughs> and she ain't say no. Sip, now, sip the I, drink. I feel you on that because a lot of times, it, it, it kind of works one way in this situation too. It'd be a lot of times where a woman will be with someone that they consider ugly, but they were their friend first. Mm -hmm. And then they was like, okay, I, it kind of grew on me. But it's rare that a dude sees a woman and he don't think they're attractive. And he Denzel at his rare. peak in Halle Berry just ain't going to be friends. It's rare. It's very ain't gonna rare. Happen. It's tough. It's impossible though. Is that what we're saying? Nothing's right. impossible. Okay. No, yes it is. But it's difficult. <laughs> it's All right, impossible. let me ask my man, how you feel about that? Yeah. Um, mm, he sweat. Cause you're Nightmare, married, you're married, you're married, married. All I'm going to say is, can you have an attractive female friend? I mean, you can. You can, you can know them. <laughs> what does that mean, know them? You can know them. <laughs> what does that mean, sir? <laughs> it means he's married. This is a married Answer. That means Papoose, you married too. Why you do me like that? He laughed. He showed you how this goes. I, He's I, I was interested in nah, his answer. Would your, how about this though? Would your wife allow you to have a platonic female friend that was fine? No. <laughs> Allow, man. Yeah. So, so why the term allow? Mm -hmm. Like, you need permission to yeah. be yeah. able that's to, why, to that's what I'm hang saying. It's called respect. That means she's able to say, no, go read a book. Yes, and well, I will go read no, a book. No, go change the baby. No, no, no. I'll tell you what it is. OK. When you get married, you take wedding vows. OK. He has to honor his queen. So if she okay. disagrees with something, he has to absolutely Damn. take that into consideration before moving forward. Okay. He can't just totally disregard her point of view. I respect that. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, maybe allow, 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 allow is probably the wrong word. That coin is. Absolutely. I would, I, would never, I would never come to my wife and be like, you can't do this. You, you will not talk to this guy like okay. this, this and the other. It's, it's more of a conversation that you're going to have as a couple. You're going to say between yourselves what your, what your threshold is, what you're mm -hmm. comfortable with, what you don't like. And once you know what you do or do not like, it's your job to honor that. Hey, listen, right? man, happy wife, happy life. Happy wife, happy That's why I laugh. That's why I laugh. Because I got to go home. Yeah. That's understandable. We got to leave now. I'm gonna ask you this, like being in the entertainment industry, there's instances where you might have to do things that your husband or wife might not like. Exhibit A, Rem is an actress. So has there ever been like an incident where she had to maybe like have an intimacy scene? Did you guys have a talk about that? Did that kind of like challenge you I'm as scared her that husband? You even ask that. I like no, because I feel like it's, a, it's, a, I think, I think it's real. You, you are a journalist. You are getting to it. Because I wouldn't ask that question. <laughs> When we come back, and next, <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it's a good question.
question because, nah, like, even, even for even me, you know, I recently did a television show, and at that time I was seeing someone, and there were intimacy scenes, you know, mm-hmm. and it's like, nasty. I seen that you know, mm-hmm. and yeah, and then, you know, you know, you feeling, you know, this prints and stuff. I mean, you know what I mean? You feeling stuff you're not supposed to be feeling. Yeah. And I think that sometimes those boundaries get crossed in the entertainment space. So is that something that you guys have ever faced before? Yeah, it's a job. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No. It's just a job. It's just, just a workplace. Mm-hmm. I would never feel insecure about it that. It never happened yeah. to me. Yeah. Like, you um, feel, like, secure. Like, she's going to honor you regardless. Exactly, regardless. Yeah. Like, yeah. my wife and I, we both actors. So it's like one of okay. those things. Okay. It's one of those things we've, to answer your question, we've had that conversation. Mm-hmm. Okay. To Papu's point, it's a job. Like, I told her, I said, look, I will never stop you from getting your bag. I will never mm-hmm. stop you from getting a role or something like that. Mm-hmm. If the role is for you, it's for you. But all I ask is, like, um, I don't want to be the last person to know. I just need to, just let me know. You now, know what, what if she got a tongue down like Damson Idris or something, or Michael B. Jordan? You ain't going to sweat? I'm not, I'm not, this I'm is not. why nobody invite you over here. <laughs> you you this is sweat. why. You, question, you ain't going to start sweating, you know what I mean? I'm going to tell you right now, if I'm married and I got a tongue kiss, Jonathan Majors, I might get a divorce. I'm just saying. But something. we the problem. See, that's <laughs> Uh, We're talking wow. about a situation no, where everybody's being respectable, yes. everybody's doing their job yes. and keeping it moving. We're right. not feeling Let's prints and all that. But if it was in the script, <laughs> that's rough. If it was in the script, no, uh, no, but y'all putting it in the script. Yeah. <laughs> y'all writing the, the script. script so that, okay. You put it in the script. Does the friend zone exist? Is the friend zone a real place? Oh, for a woman to put a man in the friend zone, it's a jail cell. But if a man puts a woman in a friend zone, it's like an apartment where she can go in and out of. Cause like you, oh, you come wow. out, a woman can come out that friend zone and come get this dick. Oh, <laughs> but it's rare that when a woman puts a man in a friend zone, yeah. come out, you can get out of yeah, it. You in the jail cell. Yeah. Like, it's different. Yeah, yeah. It's different. Go home, Roger. Go yeah. home, Roger. Yeah. Yeah. What about you, Jesse? <laughs> I've never really taken a man out of the friend zone. Have yeah. you ever been put in a friend zone? All the time. But you know that door is open. I don't or do you know. have a I've feeling? Never, I've never felt like never that. Never tried to. I'm telling you, it is. Like, for most men, there's not, there's not too many men that. Wait, are you it. telling her it is for you? Is this what's going on? What the hell is going on here? <laughs> but yeah, just came over here. Let's talk about getting put in the friend zone. So when you say, when, when you say you've been friend zone before, yeah. is this you expressing yourself? And yeah. then they're like, <clears> nah? Yeah. I've said okay. to a guy before that I was really cool with. Let's unpack this. For years, and I told him, I was like, I really, really like you, and I feel like we should be together. And then he was like, no. Now, did you just say that, or did okay. you show up it's with okay. the wedding dress? You'll find somebody that's for you. Right, exactly. Oh, no. <laughs> but no, it's okay. Pepper said, it's okay. go find somebody. <laughs> <laughs> what's she nah, is? I mean, I've received that. No, I'm like, oh, stop shit. laughing. He's really speaking life. <laughs> exactly. I'm, 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 I'm oh, now it's church. I don't want to go to church. Nobody want to go to church. Now he's speaking life. I don't want to feel discouraged by that situation. And, and feel like, yeah, no, I was, yeah. was friend zone. Yeah. It wasn't friend zone. It's okay. Good. Yeah, and it's, it's okay for it to hurt. But the thing is, it was like you were okay. You Not, our egos side. are too fragile. Yeah, yeah. why? Don't hurt my feelings. Why? Our ego is so fragile because all we've had in this world is our ego. Mm-hmm. Right? There's nothing look, to work but look, with. But look, ego, ego, they say ego stands for easing God out. Ooh. Yo, we got to be able to take rejection, man. One last question before I kick y'all out. Because uh, it's inevitable. It's inevitable. It's coming. Okay. Um, and, and Jesse, you've earned it. Uh, <laughs> is there a double standard when it comes to cheating between men and women? Do we operate differently when women cheat as compared to when men cheat? If so, tell me why. Jesse will hurry up before you get kicked out. I'm team cheat back, so. Wow. Cheat back to stay together? <laughs> what? Yeah, like, I feel like, I feel like. To make it even, I'm asking. Uh, I don't, I never heard, elaborate, what's that mean? So it's like, okay, he cheated, so it's like, oh yeah? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go do X, Y, and Z, Mm -hmm. and then we gonna act like we, or even really, because we even now. Mm -hmm. That's what I was asking. No, we're not. Are y'all together? (laughs) What does that mean? (laughs) We're not even, that's not even. How, why? I believe in didn't even want to cheat. You went and (laughs) cheat to hurt me. (laughs) That's double the hurt. That's double the hurt. Yeah, you want it to hurt me, and then you actually so hurt me. So now we're measuring so, yeah, What would I you mean, rather? Would you rather I would rather you sit there and be like, work it out and leave? Like, you like, get which so one? many. You don't even take the garbage out. Like, oh my God, <laughs> I cheated. Like, you, know, like, you don't take what? garbage out. You don't, fill your, you don't fill your gas tank. None of that. You're like, oh my God, I cheated once. Oh my God, now you got to cheat on me. I'm never going to forgive you. That's what you want to go into? You want to enter this? Why? 
So you want me to forgive you, but you ain't got forgiveness in your heart for me if yeah. I fall down nope. and make a mistake? Why not? Yes. Why not? Because you know? when you <laughs> fell down and make a mistake, you fell down on a on penis. On purpose. It wasn't That's no, why. Yeah. If you and you back, answered it someone willingly. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. that was because I was dumb. <laughs> Y'all went out to hurt me. Mm. You're Say not, that, Mouse. We're talking oh, about you back. The so back. you weren't thinking about hurting me when you went and cheated? I was thinking about right now. A release. Okay. Right now. It was a release. It's in me, and I got to get it out. This conversation is obviously happening. In like a false universe, because black men don't cheat anyway. Talk so like, this, oh lord, yeah, like, no, no, seriously, <laughs> black men Why don't cheat. It? But I think y'all are reading it wrong, and nobody's ever said it to y'all the right way. It's actually it's supposed to sound like this: black men don't cheat. Oh, yeah. but y'all still don't listen to that. But y'all still don't listen to that. Like, don't do it. Yeah, but niggas don't, don't do it. There's a lot of black men that don't cheat. I'm, I got two brothers in here right now that's basically like happily married. Well, let me yeah, ask y'all this. Have y'all ever cheated and it, and, it, and it was worth it? It's only not worth it if you get caught. Oh, Blair, I'm Somebody I'm turn your nigga mic off, man. All right. Oh, my God. I hate it here. Let, you did it again. Ask. Turn it off. Let me ask. It's only so turn his mic off. <laughs> <laughs> well, on that note, Jazzy, time for you and your friend. Get your Take your Take your apple juice. Whatever. <laughs> take your apple juice. Take your water. Take it to go. Take it to go. All right. Bye, y'all. 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 Bye, y'all.